yo, get cozy, my friend. We are just about to get started with a Nova Mirror, Static Gorilla versus Kid Legend. Uh, Shout to Static Gorilla is a player that I actually have some in-person tournament experience with. He beat me. He bought me. Oh. I lost the Super Scroll. So, I know it's real. That is a pain to deal with. But Kid Legend with first blood so far. Yep. Good jump out, avoid the drone, slow things down a little bit. That's a great push block, but hesitated on the way down. I think overall the defense there was played perfectly. Just got to be willing to press. Willing to press. That's a pretty good uh, <laughs> game plan for Nova in general, especially in the mirror. Y'all know these guys are going to be slanging. They're going to be calling assists. That gorilla trying to put something together, but so far he's on the losing end. Not dead, though. These trades are going horribly. Yep, he's going to go for the super super. Definitely the right call. Second rock punch actually beats it clean because it was already active. That gorilla goes for the raw tag and does get away with it though. That's good. Is this one of the expansion pack colors for Nova? It is, right? It is, absolutely. I wish this was the base game. Holy. I was about to say, yo, <laughs> what is that? It is I wish this crazy. was the base game. Okay, so here's my hot take for this matchup as he gets hit. I think I actually think I think Sentinel fights Nova. Yeah, okay. I see that. That absolutely makes sense. I mean, people say that a lot of that. With Hulk as well. It's like that armor hitbox that challenges the dolphin. Okay, tags back in Nova. Probably a good idea. Sentinel was about to die. Nobody home. Wow, these uses of the pulse. We're missing conversions off of them, but the uses of the pulse have been good. But there's the clean hit. We'll take it down to the floor. Should be able to take a kill. Only one bar required. Not too bad. That was a long time before somebody died. Not common in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Is Static Gorilla going to make something of this? That was a juicy confirm. At the TAC, though, so it is blocked. And this one's a kid legend. I was going to say, we're trying to look to get it out of here. Misses out and does actually escape, so has time to potentially Whoa. go for the tag with the last hit of the dive. Dude, come on. Top rope. Super top rope. Okay. That was Shio! That was such a good sequence, but he actually drops it by canceling too early with the S in the air. And now the Dark Wesker is engaged. Psych, it is booked. Yeah, I mean, that was a... Wait a minute. Oh, oh no. Uh, Knew he was going to go yo. straight to the ground. I like the call out for Static Gorilla. That's confidence. Confidence is key in situations like that. I like that. Good call. Yeah, he's a sniper with the command grab. I remember vividly playing against him and dealing with that command grab myself. He definitely is always looking for it. Sometimes he overextends a little bit too much with it, but nice job, Static Gorilla. Taking the first game in the Nova Mirror. Okay, Kid Legend with a chance to, to get something started, though. Yeah, I mean, first real confirm here off of the uh, off the pulse, but unfortunately drops again. We got to get some... Uh, honestly and truly, all of it comes down to for both players. I feel like they're both playing neutral pretty well. We have to clean up these hits. Yes. Get some conversions. Thank you, Shinima Plays, coming in with the subby. Our first prime of the night. You only get one prime. Such a kind thing to drop it here. Thank you so much for parking with us. Oh, well, he gets out and he gets the hit. Messes up the plink, though. Yeah, that's one. Of, oh, I was gonna say. I think that's a, a deterrent for a lot of people when it comes to playing scroll. Is that it's a. Uh, it's scary how much if you mess up your dashes, it's easy to get. Uh, be like minus seven hundred. Just yes. <laughs> whipping swings with good kill. Standing low, getting a little bit of action from Super Scroll there. Nicely done. Static Gorilla then finds the incoming juggle. Are we going to get Super Scroll combos? Sort of. Okay. <laughs> Hidden Missile breaks it up. Convenient. No way that hits. All right. Wow. And he lands a command throw. I think, honestly, I think that's a good call, especially if you think he, there's a potential for him to go for the X Factor. I think that beats the X Factor clean. Yeah, that was a pretty solid response. And, you know, the, the quote-unquote anchor of the team is neutralized. Doctor Doom anchor is definitely a thing. This is a good start. So we get the bait and the punish. Now yeah, as soon, combo. As, as soon as he popped his X-Factor there, that he's kind of cooked in that spot. It's really good from Kid Legend here. One mix-up away. Yeah, it really got baited, man. Incoming. It's dirty. Not dirty enough. Static Gorilla just gets out. We have a little bit of X-Factor time left. Okay, we're trying to box things in. That's what we're trying to do. Nice punish, well Dude. done. Super no. clean punish, but drop the combo again. Still, I mean, you have the life lead here, and as long as you're not uh, predictable with your fireball patterns, I think Doom does pretty well in this. I agree, I absolutely agree. Gonna have to manage, mitigate the threat from Super Scroll, and he actually had it. But he's not able to confirm. Oh, he's so low. Can we get over top of this? Not oh, quite. I thought maybe he was going to death sentence hits on the same side. I think Kid Legend thought it was going to cross up. 
But in the corner in a spot like that, that actually cannot cross up, I don't think. And if you're holding backwards, especially if you up back like that, I don't think it's possible for it to cross up. Yeah, just wasn't ready. I do agree. Probably could have just up back and solved that, but was not ready. Kind of gorilla goes up 2-0. Oh, we're getting the switch to the hanger oh. here. I've seen Kid Legend play this before. The corporation. I, yeah. I This is another one uh, where I think that... Um, I think Nova wins it for sure, but it, this is very annoying and very scary. Hagar takes trades, uh, which Nova just hates. Nova hates people who can trade with him. That's just like his the, the most frustrating matchup is people that make you have to respect the things that he does as we get the reset. You're too young for that, man. No way. Come on. <laughs> that young disrespect. I love to see it. Nice and efficient. I don't hate testing him. It is really risky to do when you're down 0 2, but I don't hate it. He's trying to cage his super score right now, though. Static Gorilla doing a good job moving around. Uh oh. Still fine. Oh my god, on the back. Listen, I watched. I've seen comics that have this character in it, and I've seen him survive a lot of bad things. Pipe, though? No, 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 no. <laughs> Come on. Not even Galactic super scroll. level power. Oh, that team super sucks, though. Thankfully, we were able to finish it with the chip sequence on the other side. Nice block. Okay. I like the disrespect from Static Gorilla. We weren't able to find the confirm. That's cool. Wedge Kid just Legend's made like, him I'm chilling. Wedge just made an amazing point. Kid Legend literally just used a mix-up that might have been invented before he was born. Uh, with the with the throw wow. reset. <laughs> wow. You're absolutely right. That was a Wedge. That's good, dude. That Oh my god, but he's gonna get the kill off that. That's a good use of the X Factor, too. Overall, I'm impressed with the Hagar. Two to one. Static Gorilla is still in the lead, but the corporation is creeping up, dude. Capitalism might win on this one. Uh, yeah, Static Gorilla knew he had to slow it down. That's his imp like, this combo. imperative. 100%. You have to check Hagar in his startup. That's like where you can beat him at. Don't try to challenge him when his buttons are already out. Really? Crispy movement. <laughs> Dude, and he goes launcher after that too to make sure it's gonna work. Oh, man. Counter hit headbutt combo is a lot of fun. Are you kidding me? Wow, and he super jumped to try and go for something tricky there. Static Grill is gonna find the hit off of it though. Should be able to very easily kill Hagar for it. Really? But he goes for the TAC. You are. Man. Really? Oh, Proxy. He's, he's flexing for the stream. He's flexing for the stream. I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. 100%. Handshake. That was off the TAC. Yes. Juggles no good this time. <laughs> standing heavy punch. Almost, or standing heavy kick. Almost actually. No, it ruins it. He converts with X Factor? Yo. Dude. And Yo. he has the teleport link, but oh, I think you have to go crouching medium there, or maybe it just has too much hits on scaling at that point. Does it matter though? No, Fucking Kid Legend. Is this happening? Is this happening? Proxy, is it happening? Oh, I thought what? that was a. I would have bet everything. Oh my god, I thought it was a command throw. Boxed in, misses the overhead. He doesn't get out, and he trades. That's a. Oh, that's, he's got it. He's got this. A he Sentinel. Oh mm. no, I think Wesker versus Sentinel is really, really annoying. Oh yeah. This is super bad, especially with Beam. I feel like Sentinel can do okay without Beam, but Beam is like a deal breaker on this. Yeah, between the gunshot and the beam, pretty obnoxious. We go ahead and use a bar. Don't get the juggle. That's pretty tough to catch. Teleport's over. Nice neutral. Nice neutral. Yeah, taking shots, dashing in afterwards to make sure he's not losing too much real estate, and then dashing backwards because you know you have to maintain space against Sentinel. Oh, come on. And he gets to confirm level three. You're telling me a you're telling me an eleven year old's playing this neutral? What? Huh? No way. Nah, we ain't got those DHCs. TK misses the TK, but it's just going to go for the standard stuff. Nice and simple. I'm actually not sure if it's more damage if you start with TK, if we just go that way. Yeah, okay. Either way, I think he's going to barely just not have enough. Yeah. Oh, it drops. Oof. And look at the time. Yeah. I mean, right at this point, TikTok. 11 seconds left on the clock. Things getting super messy here. What a Missiles. Decision. Yeah, that was super smart. Seven seconds though has to hit him actually immediately. What happened? Jumps out. 
We're still barely alive. This will probably end up to do it. Yes, it is. Kid Legend ties it up. I really like the idea from Kid Legend to stall it out and go for the the lane play, the hidden missiles. It was an awesome response from Static Gorilla to go full screen and command throw him. But, uh, dude, this is, a, this is a sick first match. This is really, really nasty. And again, this is for anybody that doesn't know, Kid Legend is like 11 years old. He's like, he's like a kid, like not just like a name, yeah. like like how people put like like little in their tag. It's like actually a kid. He's so good. <laughs> okay, and he checks the low. legs. That's so smart because you know he's up backing. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. And he baits out the Lariat into the air Lariat. Yeah, because it's the last hit of the Lariat, too. He's able to get the conversion solo. Oh. Whoa! Guy scraper. <laughs> Caught him. Caught him doing something. But we dropped the combo. I'm so surprised he didn't get hit with the Lariat there. Oh, my God. That should have been a Lariat. He's alive. He's dead. And he Guaranteed chip. This. Oh, no. Oh no. 50% of life missing from Dr. Doom. The anti or the air to air juggle is good. The conversion is good. That's a dead Dr. Doom. It's going to be up to Wesker. We can absolutely make this happen if we just touch the ground. That's the mix up. Oh, the high low though. No X? Hello? Are we straight? I can't believe. X would have made it close, but I can't believe you don't just spend it immediately. Mm -hmm. He blocks that. You have to X? Oh my god, he hit him with a day one. Static Gorilla says, I'm gonna hit you with uh, something else you haven't seen. Oh my god. Oh no. Another primer in the house, and Static Gorilla with the subby. If I was sweating, there would be a flood. Bro. <laughs> All right, next match at the point is going to be Wesker from Sandwich versus Joker starting Magneto. Also plays kind of an uncharacteristic zero team. They're both, they're both like that. I uh, definitely agreed. I mean, I feel like Joker just has like a really good uh, understanding of how to use drones at this point. Anybody who's still on Sentinel uh, has like a magic sense for how to use those projectiles. Because when you play Sentinel, it can. Oh my! A lot happens there. But in the end, Sandwich gets ahead of the scramble. Drones is not as easy to call as I think people think it is. No. It's easy to get destroyed for it. Yeah. And Sandwich plays extremely fast. That is, I would say, like, if there was a stat chart, right? If we're talking, like, NFL player cards. Yeah. Uh, for, for Sandwich, the speed stat is max. The aggressive stat is max. They like to go in. They like to be in your face. Kind of hit you with these situations. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I don't think what he was looking for there. I will also say the luck stat is very high on this guy because he loves to go for the crazy situations. He seems to always come out on top of them. It's uh, it's interesting to watch for sure. He just did crouching heavy bionic arm. There. Like that's like the that's the vibes for my boy Sandwich. The block bionic arm. No, the Joker is gonna get this touch of death combo if he completes the lightning boost. Doesn't matter how much life you have. If you're a big character, if you're a little character, we already know the story. Chooses the X factor here. That's pretty interesting. Okay. I think Make it's correct. Sure. Yeah. I don't hate it. Double two definitely factor engage. Oh, oh we convert those absolutely. No, the drone messed it up actually, but it doesn't matter. Still gets the cross up. Done. Done. It's possible. Okay, it's possible. Three meters. Almost four. Oh, you get bullied out of one. That sucks. That's a big L. Oh, really? yep, absolutely nice whiff punish. And now, we're in danger, though. Several. Ooh, really? That almost converts into so good, man. Are you serious? Yeah, and he has DP assist, which I think is a huge equalizer in that. Uh, it's Sentinel versus Doom is a matchup we've seen uh, through time and time again, ages throughout the ages. Uh, definitely feels even-ish. With an mm -hmm. assist like that that prevents jump-ins, I feel like that's heavily Sentinel favored. Agreed. Sentinel already does pretty solid against Dr. Doom, who has the awkward movement pattern. So let's see if Sandwich can get this Wesker engage again. It was a big part of their success early on. A lot of damage in Magneto already. Ooh, but we get juggled though. Yikes. Ooh, sandwich, I was gassing you up. Oh, no. He's going to get out of it. No, he's not. He's dead. Nah, easy squeeze. That should be all she wrote. Oh, the Instructor does not bro, kill him. Here comes Bionic Arm. No, he's going to chill. No arm? 
I'm telling you, he, Wait, he, he this what? is what he is. It's in his soul. It's burned into his identity. Dude, he hit him. Oh, he is. This is like that. This is some inside stuff. You know what I'm saying? You ride or die Wesker point no matter what. Yes. Oh yes. my god. And now we chill? We block? Just what is happening? Less. Oh, okay, hold on. Okay, he's back. He's back. He's back. Oh, he's gone. It's over. We thought we were back, but it's actually over. Shout out to QC Sports. I see you guys. What's up, homies? What's up, in the house? Ooh. We got a five piece for Mad Lust Envy as well. Thank you for the direct con contribution to the match arena. We appreciate you guys. As well as money bags. Can I get a woo woo? No, Joker KP, has nothing. Oh, sorry. Woo -woo. No woo woo. There you go. Oh, come on, man. I was about to say. <laughs> come on, no, man. That was for money bags. I got you. <laughs> what is this? DHC glitch? That's what it felt like. It's a combo into another combo. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Things get messy, though. Should we all tech forward? Yep. You like that one? <laughs> oh my god. Damn, I mean, an another one of those moments where things get super scrambly. Sandwich gets the better of it. He's still alive. How? You ever play Injustice? I feel like he has Aquaman yeah. passes. <laughs> <The> slippery. <laughs> That's There's so log. Good block. Now back in the neutral. Spencer just zips in and kind of gets a schmack. No dice. Air to air. Apparently TNS Sandwich will be one of the finalists in B-Man Sunday Final Jeopardy. That Jeopardy's a lot of fun. I enjoy it. Good juggle. He's dead. Finish it. Finish it, man. Yeah, whatever it takes at this point. Leave Dr. Doom on his own. There's two matchups that he really would rather not have to face down. I would trade that in a weird way, so... Back to the zoning. Has plenty of meter to get out if he wants to. Just hate seeing zero throw fireballs full screen. It's the worst feeling in the world. Sandwich tries to get a test and he succeeds. We get in, we get the kill. Liquidated man. No! Zero! Yeah, you can't do that extension very easily against zero. You gotta be careful. Oh, but he mistimes his stuff and he's gonna die for it. And now Dr. Doom has to block a mid screen mix up. But he's fine. He chills. Damn, faulty thing in the chat. What's up, faulty? I see you. Dr. Doom getting zoned right now. Psych. Psych, your neck is broke. <laughs> the classic. Yeah, that's how you kill Titan, dog. Right in the back of the neck. Easy peasy. Way to take him down. Two to one. Again, sandwich. The luck stat is going insane. I have no idea how this guy is still alive. My favorite stat in Fallout. Wesker backing up, getting close. Magneto trying to chase him down. What are we calling that? We calling that <laughs> zero uppercut like a hacker. Joker had to play Marvel 2, right? Like, it just, I can sense it. What's green coming? Easy. It's just unblockable. It's, yeah. It doesn't matter what character, Nova, Wesker, it, uh, it's just unblockable. Yeah, that's why we play that assist, baby. <laughs> One more time for the fans. <laughs> what a on the jump Oh, but Sentinel sucks. Sentinel sucks. He had him. Joker played so much better than him right there. Oh, my God. Horrible character. Oh, Lux dude. Luckstat going wild. Look that going wild, bro. And he's going to set up for the hard... This, this is actually a hard DHC. Nah. Hard enough, bro. <laughs> next patch. They got that on the next patch. Super, super. TNS sandwich, bro, by the skin of his teeth, bro. That just... That felt, that felt wrong. I don't like that. Look that was going wild. Have it quite like that. Dude, so. Speaking of which... Freaking Dizzy in the chat. I see you, Dizzy. That's Dizzy D. That's D Dizzy. I see you, bro. D Dizzy. <laughs> I haven't seen that homie in forever. Well, good to see you, player. Welcome to the Friday night. Apology Boy versus Jason Kiddo. Apology Boy repping the top tier stuff, the Chris G stuff. And Jason, of course, doing his thing with his team. Starting Dormammu. I think this is, you know, probably the best option. 
No, against uh, against Morgan, I definitely think so. I think that the best thing to do, uh, I think all three are fine, but he either will do like a suicide game plan with Hagar to get two bars, or he'll start dorm. I think either one is fine. Yeah, that's not a good start for Jason though. At least you can tag in Hagar and have all that that neat stick HP to go through again. Psych, psych, you just tag in Hagar and you win. Easy. You just kill two both, characters. no problem. What could go wrong? Dropkick as an anti-air, that's cool. Doesn't yeah, <laughs> straight, it doesn't matter. Okay, set it up though. Definitely smart, makes the X-Factor come out. And then, yeah, no. setting up the flame carpet there before you tag is really just the nail in the coffin. Apology Boys tries, tries to take a turn in kind of a crazy way. Not gonna work out in the end. Kiddo covers every, he covers all the bases. Covers all the bases, that's what he does. He's also kind of like, I would say, the most on point with Lariats of any hacker player I've ever seen. It's it's insane how critical his his Lariat usage is. So we will see that be coming into play later on. Is Dormammu going to get something started this time, though? It's kind of rough last game. Ooh, I see you, Lucy Lou. Thank you with the $5. Is that we appreciate Lucy that. Lou? Is it? <laughs> Thank you for the five. <laughs> oh, he gets full ticket. This time it's Dormammu. You know, it just is, it's that easy. Cap Dormammu in. Tag two. What can go wrong? Don't worry. They got this team on the next patch. They're getting, they're getting a nerf. 100%. Ooh, and you lose a bar. Oh, that's such a feel bad, man. You do get Virgil, though. You did lose Virgil, though. Oh, kiddo gets Virgil. <laughs> Apology boy. Unfortunately, gonna have to wait another game to get the pilot of Virgil, dude. Feels bad, man. I played, uh, I played a little bit of Virgil in my day, 100%. I'm not afraid to admit it. I'm a user, and uh, it's such a horrible feeling when your Virgil comes in and dies in the incoming mix-up. You just feel all that wasted potential just flushed right before your eyes, right between your fingers. Counterpoint, that's what you get. Boo. For Pick a Virgil. Definitely Ooh. booze for the crowd for sure. Absolutely. Devil Embracer. Devil Embracer. Counter, counterpoint, that's what you get. So it works out that way. Yeah, I mean, Jason's team, by all accounts, is definitely not something you would just like look at on paper and be like, yeah, that's top tier. Like, like you know, <laughs> it's, it's, it's one of the best teams that you can see in the meta these days, but. The way that they developed it between him and Voodoo, you know, look, look at this, man. There's so much potential. Recognizing the heights that you can do that Dormammu, because there's like three separate versions of that, like super jump height flight, depending on where you hit them and the size of the character you have to do. Dude, I feel like you do so much math with Dormammu for like normal mm. stuff. Like no, as Nova, I'm chilling. I'm asleep and I'm <laughs> confirming that. Dorm is working so hard in that spot. <laughs> I'm napping, bro. I'm dude. I'll keep it a buck. I'll I'll never downplay my characters. Nova's stupid. I can just do whatever. Dorm had to do so much math to fix that combo. That's comedy. That's absolutely comedy. Is Virgil gonna get started? Hey, yo, no meter. Maybe he don't spin X. So we're we're kind of out. We're playing. We're chilling. Nice confirm. Psych. There is some amount of a chance. Good tech. Oh, uh, is that a punish or was he just he got caught sleeping? Nah, you did not just beat him like that. Damn. Dude. <laughs> Kiddo. He is uh he's looking strong. Hagar, no shirt out in the snow. Not a care in the world. He's I'm built for this. Yeah, I'm from yeah, the north. Who cares? That would be kinda hot. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, we're getting into this. It's no So who did D hud Clobber? Six games in a row. Well, I do remember D. Okay, I do remember D. Hut. I, 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 it's a, a just it was lost in the sea of Novas in my brain. My brain contains a lot of Nova information, so it's a uh, it's overloaded. Mm -mm. Okay. Dad. Okay. Bro, come on, man. Oh, baby. <laughs> come on, man. I think I'm seeing why the six O was there. To okay. My bad. My bad. I didn't mean that, D. Hut. I'm sorry, player. I did that to you. He's still fine. Still fine. He got this. Jumps out of the command throw. Okay. So X for X. And then we do the Oh, what? Considering the drop, he played the layers after that actually really, really well. Like, a Legend did also, but all the X factors off the table, all the resources off the table, you've got to favor the Nova team on that one. Stream Jitters. That was 100% Stream Jitters. Have, have to believe. 
But we got the we got the meaty, but a good push guard from Living Legend to escape. Mmm, a little too far. Anything will do it. Yep. Plasma beam good enough. Keep it meaty. Okay. It's one of the best Akumas in the business. Yeah, as far as the active Akumas, there's not a lot of players that have better results than this guy. Living Legend consistently puts this guy on the table. Not quite enough to kill. Ooh. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, get him out no. of there. Ooh. Yeah, DP beats us super clean. It's high priority and is invincible to projectiles, but it can get destroyed by invincible reversals. I just love seeing <laughs> sure use hit in Marvel 3. That's True. a good time. Oh, no conversion. That was so weird. That oh, was weird. nothing weird about this. Yeah, no, this is standard. Anti-weird. Anti-weird. That's, an, that's this team is just baked with yeah, consistency. A, this is unweird. South Aeonian is definitely one of those. Typical. Uh, there you go. Thank you, Fear. <laughs> Oh, a little stutter step, Chris. Oh okay. My. I like the little old man stagger action. Trying to go for the double lows with Chris, man. How often do you see that? Yeah, Chris is never winning this. There's like, no way. Chris this never wins that. Never. Like, literally, literally, Peasy Boy with the Cinco was a thousand times more likely than a Chris comeback with no X Factor on three characters. I'd okay, probably Chris, take Arthur. Chris can win this one, though. Yes. He's in there. He's clobbering. We started Wesker last time, no? So this time we did it up. Immediate results. Bruh. Wow. Normal man mix. Dude, it just is. Yes. Give Ryu that. He said in and real life, I, like, I could have done that. He just, he's just punching. Man, boy, just swinging. Level I three. I found the buff that Ryu needs. It's a fire grenade. Boulder punch? Or <laughs> boulder punch. I'm taking it. Backs Check off. Smart decision. Oh, and I love using the Magnum multiple times in a row. I mean, as D HUD, uh, you got to take a risk at that point. Doom is not gonna be able to do too much in spots like that. He's just kind of gonna have to, uh, you know. Yeah, you, you have a you have a puncher's chance in in those uh, scrambling mm -hmm. situations, right? Yeah, you need something explosive. You need something kind of to just take over. Ooh, we had a chance. We had a chance. It was a snowball's chance. It was there. Ties it up. Living Legend one on one. Ooh, voice of a car time. 20 bucks. Thank you, voice. We appreciate you. Big yeah, support thank, coming in. Thank you very much. That's putting our match arena almost to 50. So there will be more when Remora is out. I, voice, I appreciate that. As a, we can call this shot. No, no, no. It's DXP, bro. You got to call this shot. Wait for DXP to lose, and then you can throw it in. Ooh, he's dead. He was dead. Oh, Chris might be dead, though. That's a if you rough trade, Chris, but we take it. Yeah, I mean, losing out on your beam is a such a horrible thing for this team, but we're going to go for the snap. He's going to match Demon Flip. Mm. He chills? He chills. That's the first time I think I've ever seen him not. He is so consistently goes for, like, aggressive options there that people have to, like, rethink how they approach. Second time. What? Second what? time that happened. Second time that happened, and man, now you lose Dr. Doom, so you don't have that hard tag engine in your team. Kind of rough. Gonna have to hold this. DHC. Can we punish here? No. No. At best, you get like Javelin. And then this. Full screen. Yeah, I, you let Nova rock, right? Yeah, 100%. You, you want the anchor spins. Because. Well, a blocked bionic arm is a... Oh, he, really? he tried him. He tried him. He tried him. He tried him. In that spot, a blocked bionic arm is a win for sure. Because yeah. obviously X-Factor, even if they do... A, we The metagame of push blocking Spencer after bionic arm has evolved like 30 times so throughout the life goofy. of this game. There's so much I know that he knows, that she knows, that we know that goes into that one push block. But Spencer still gets a look. And it's good enough. We've seen LT do that a hundred times make magic out of nothing pretty much out of thin air but right now d hud down so six straight games including a 3-0 and two to max now Dude. down in games against living legend and living legend playing like an assassin that's tough and i living legend historically uh i try not to bring it up too much because they don't want to be too negative about stuff right but like a legend has had problems like Nova. with novas he's had like problems him. with novas dude he's looking real looking like he's not he's never had a nova problem in his life but may, you know maybe special hey. problem 
Hey, you notice how his kid was playing Nova. You think he made him? <laughs> He's like, boy, I need a matchup. You gonna learn so I can learn. You gonna train me. Uma's dead, though. It's a massive one for the uh... Really? That's kind of weird there, but... Wesker escaped. How's this gonna interact? Those are the hit. Oh, I think he buffered teleport. That weird crouch. I'm not sure what else that could have been. Super dead. Chris is gonna have to hold so much. Ooh, getting a little flaily though. Let's let's chill out. Come on, D HUD. Not the not the stinger, bro. The bro. laser bro. The Lincoln tablet. <laughs> Holy oh here comes God. the super. Does get a cross up. He's gonna go for the uh the second super. Does actually hit. A little bit for it. And he finds the touch afterwards. D HUD. Didn't look like he was gonna get anything for that. It looked like it was just gonna be a safe DHC, but it turns into a lot more, but not a kill. What can you do? It's not a kill, but he's basically just, okay, yeah, yeah. He's, he's cooked. Chris super jumping forward, shooting guns with no assist behind him. You, you gotta, you have to know that you can be brave there, but you just gotta be brave enough forward into him. Yeah, pretty bad situation. d -Hud ties it up, two to two. Dashes in. Be back with the subby, with another prime. I see you. Shout out to the primers. He says, bring the pain. He's trying to, man, but Chris is gonna go down. DHC, DHC, won't be much more than that. Shatter coin, the legend. The legend. Enter the chat. I see you, Shatter. Dude, he blocks the legendary double zip also. Mm. That's definitely dark tech. Thought so, you know, Spencer. <laughs> Not the he hit him with it and he was ready. Oh Look at my him. god. This is a good X though. Definitely the right decision. Been super. It doesn't do too much with Akuma with X Factor. Way more than enough. Shadow Kuma with two more gifted subbies. Yes. Double dip. I love you. Thank you, Shadow Coin. Appreciate it, man. Thank you as always. Super kill another one. Nova Something Anchor, Nova. buddy. This is, yeah, Nova Anchor. Not What's your favorite thing about Nova Anchor? <laughs> Dude, my favorite thing about Nova Anchor is getting to the next game, but unfortunately <laughs> we don't have that luxury in this one. He's uh -oh. out. Okay. Yo, that was fast. Just trying to walk him down, but it's so hard. Gets hit and scramble too. And that should be just enough. Obviously, like we said, that Team Super doesn't do too much, but way more than enough. Easy finish there for Living Legend, but D-Hud is playing very good tonight. I'm getting the well, match. Get, get anyway, the off me, bro. <laughs> Liberal Terminator versus Zenpool. Deadpool versus Nova. I feel like I mean, Nova probably does all right. Yeah. Uh, you like this matchup or not? Oh, no, I hate it. I hate playing okay. it. I think it's really annoying. I think Nova can do okay. Because of Hadoken assist, right? Yeah, of course. No. <laughs> I think Nova can do okay. It's just Deadpool is just such a... Uh, he's just such a... He's a character, man. I don't know how to describe that better. You know what I mean? He's a twerp. Yeah, he definitely is. Super we annoying that, style. We've been using that word for Street Fighter a lot recently. I think it applies perfectly here. Deadpool is absolutely a twerp. Okay. We get out, but we have to spin the bar. Nobody home. Hurricane Kitten. Shout out to one of our TOs, one of our admins. Showing some love. Enjoy the gifted sub, beautiful Rose. This is the LT Classic. The Nova puts him down, but he is by no means out. One of the best finishers in the business. Hard tag into Doom. This is a super dead Deadpool. Damn. Gripped him up. He's a kill. Even things up. But uh, when I say even, I just mean in terms of character, you know? Just like, like the numbers. What are you saying total. about Ree, bro? Saying mm, launcher mm, beats him clean. Okay, mm. good break on the TAC though. And he, ambitious TK Tatsu. Ambitious. I like it. Team aerial combo that translates to dead Ryu. 100% LT is going to hit this. He got these on the internet. We seen him hit the. Okay. All right. Bruh. Bruh. 
Why you do me like that? Oh I'm my! Never mind. Ryu's broken. I'm assassinated. Ryu's crazy. Jesus! It was from so he far extra damage. too. He does he extra absolutely, damage. and he gets his uh. Do you another super? Oh, you get a Ryu's whole thing my... there. Ryu sucks. Nope, drops. Ryu sucks. Wait, hands on controller? LT? Rules. Oh, you're dead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, he's all the way dead. Okay. Oh, uh, you gotta know. Uh, maybe he just miscalculated and thought he was gonna have a bar by then we have because of the block normals, but you oh, gotta sure. know. Yeah, he's punching, man. He's 100% punching. Cancel overhead into DP. Ooh, Living Legend trying to share a little bit of Kuma tech. That would've been cool. Yeah. I just, I, I don't even know if he had the meter. If he did, absolutely. You, you just like, you actually you won that situation. DP, you know? I just super DP, just kill him. Yeah, fair. I don't think you can cancel uh, it with a special. Maybe he maybe. got nothing. Now he's got to fight for another win on the board after he already beat Nova Ooh. one time. He's gonna do it a second time. Back to back, good start for Zimple Man. Can bang, bang. Oh. Today I learned. Ooh. Damn the triple three. No way he grapples three times there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Max distance cracks the dome. Oh, we jump out and demon flip. Nimble fighting. Get out of there. Get, get him. No. I'm showing my bias. I'm showing my bias. Oh, that's a good tag, though. LT. It was a demon. First up. Ryu next one in. Dude. The one grapple. Every, see, everybody's used to the two. Chooses to spin just in case. Oh, he did that. Noxious. He did that in Nova's honor. With Nova dead, he was like, this is for my fallen brother. 16 jabs. Classic stuff from LT. Two games in a row. But they, I mean, they've been manageable. Been Deadpool's fighting, definitely though. been in it. Yeah, we've been fighting. He's been fighting. 100%. You also got to consider, uh, we don't bring it up too often because obviously playing online, things work out pretty well. But uh, Zempel was on a significantly worse connection than LT also. But he's, LT, he's the pain warrior. LT is gaming for sure. That's the, the risk of being a West Coast player entering an East Coast bracket. As people do for uh, the, uh, the different West Coast tournaments too. It should be like that. The nature of the beast entering these online brackets. You have no hope. Reuse cooked. Tag in Nova. No, we're just going to run it. Oh. oh. Wow, Prog. Long time. Big fan. Good to see you, homie. Yeah, love you, Proggy. Good to see you. I don't think I've seen you in the TNS chat in a minute, man. It's been Looking a minute. Been Hell yeah. Oi, Ooh. Bolo? I like that. Really good choice. Is going to go for the X Factor as well. Damn, shoot him up. Spencer and Nova remain. Spencer, cook. Mm. Oh, he blocked it. I called it in advance. Mm. I was so mm. ready. Is this a punish? No, it's a dead Akuma. Yikes. He tries to go for the punish. It was just a little bit too late. The bionic arm into the x is going to give him everything he needs. Yo. Okay. What? Ah. Like, come on, man. Okay. Yeah, had to do him like that, but he does it anyways. 3 OLT over Zenpool. And I had I have like a thousand hours of slave fire. But let's get to the match. Let's get into it. Dude, Viper, huh? Yeah, Viper starts. So this is something that King Carlos and, and Joker do. They like to switch it up a little bit. Uh, between their two point characters, they literally play double point character teams, which is like easily i would say the most uncommonly represented uh archetype in marvel 3. oh he just gets in though let's go yeah that should be an easy kill off of this obviously uh viper super does a ton of damage and her dhing into zero which even if he doesn't go loops for koha is just like we forget that's a very good super Yes, it is. It is am amusing that because the lightning loops are so strong, we do get that with Koha. It's not bad. We have to X here. Dr. Doom still getting punished. I'm interested to see the follow-up, and it's juicy, bro. The quick work with this. Ooh. Okay. 
I give a formal congratulations to KP, by the way. Finally, <laughs> finally it, somehow, baby. has just become a moderator in the chat. I've after it, after many moons. I after many it. moons, dude. <laughs> Watch out. Oh, my God. Doing exactly what you're supposed to do. Shouts to Catterbot giving the gifted sub to my man, Big P. Damn, dude. Normally I uh, I send my prime here, but you got, you got me. I'll have to use somewhere else. Wherever we raid tonight is where my prime is going. Push out to use for But anyways, <laughs> Deadpool getting pressed into the corner. Viper finishes it up. Incoming. We, we go for the level three. No, we have to take that. And we do. Viper fights out. Yeah, weasel shot ended up in a weird spot. Because we jump back. Still fine. Chipping out. Oh, maybe thought Strider was going to connect there. That's a weird one. But still, Psycho Crusher fixes it. Mm. No, he's alive. Come on. No, he's alive. He's not dead. Damn. We like it. Yeah. Wedge is solid with every character. Probably most known for their Deadpool, but solid with every character. Okay. Hate this guy so much, man. They did such a good job of like just making him so obnoxious, stupid, meany, and he's a zoner, and he's got a teleport, and he's beating up your assist character. Yo, what just what just cheat? Oh, it definitely is. I mean, Deadpool in general is cheap, man. Having these two crazy anti-air assists. It's, it's, it's nasty that this character controls so much space on the ground that you're able to commit to double anti-air assists and things just work out for you still. I see you, Squirrel. Big booty Tong, no pants, vape nation. Tong not here, holding it down with the team out of rewire, but I'll hit a blinker for you. Don't worry. Nice struggle. Zero is low HP. We could kill this if we want to. No, we choose to snap in the Viper. Nah. Do you think that's appropriate? I mean, she would uh, go. I am a big fan of killing Zero no matter what. Thanks. So definitely not. I mean, it's working out. As long as it works. In the end, if it works, if you won, good read, good call. It's not, you know. As long as you win, it'll be fine. I mean, Zero is super certainly capable by themselves. One of the most capable solo characters. Nice conversion, too. Are we going to lose this? No, keeps it nice and safe. I like that. I like the way that they adapted that combo. Very, very well done. And the Sogenmu active. Ooh, good oh. watch wedge. Dude, that late dash ended up in a weird spot. And he gets the fix. He gets the dive kick. King Carlos. This is why we kill Zero, man. And he gets yeah. the TAC just because. Just because he this felt like good. it. For no reason. Shout out to Shattercoin. Giving the gifted stuff to Marvel Time. We are engaged in Marvel Time at this point. And what's up, Robbie? Coming in with the 23 months of support. We appreciate you guys. Oh, he gets a weird one there. I feel like he's yeah. Rob. Definitely a very strange hit, but things work out in the end still. Breaking through for the most part. Bajra hits both. You can't just call assists like that in weird ways. And then... Uh, dude, the seventh occurrence in history of Legion killing a character. So much happening at once. Wedge is a sniper. He's an absolute sniper. He plays for keeps. Likes to swing for the big hits. Finds another one. Pretty sure that's a 2-0 lead. Am I wrong? Is it 1-0? Did I just miss it? Miss it? Am I tripping? I'm not sure. King Carlos trying to fight for neutral, though. Rare that you see Zero get agitated in the neutral zone, right? It's like... Wesker Gunshot can kind of do this as well, and Deadpool can do it so non-committal with the fireballs. Nicely done. Yeah, I mean, that's, I feel like some of our best matches we've ever seen have been like... Uh, remember, you had you, you asked me about what my favorite set was, and it actually was Deadpool oh, vs. Yeah, Zero, dude. Did Low key. That. Yeah, it's, dude, it's, a, it's fun to watch when it's top level. Shout out to the uh, KP, Coast to Coast, and my one and only guest, Proxy. That was, was, that was great. It was the only so fun, dude. We capped it off. One yeah, episode, peak. It's over. Yeah, shout out to my internet company charging me two hundred dollars <laughs> for that stream. But anyways, oh, with the gifted cool. sub, the Goki, I appreciate you, homie, showing the love to one of the friends. Viper getting cooked. Oh, an X Factor. That's chill. I mean, Doom kind of sucks. Jesus, it's not even that Doom sucks. It's that Wedge is nasty. What a crazy sequence to finish that off. Should be able to build. Just enough, I think. Volcano Beehive builds a ton. It's one pixel away, dude. 
That was ridiculous. He's still alive. King Car is literally alive with a pixel, like you said. One meter left after we spin this, and so far no opening. He just stingers, man. Fearlessness and the heart of danger. Wedge advances 3-0 over King Carlos. Yeah, I mean, Wedge at that point, Stinger kind of uh, kind of fixes everything. Oh my god. Guys, it's another Deadpool, by the way. It's time to shoot him up. We know how we had that like spike of Shumagora. It was like so suddenly we were seeing it everywhere. It was, you know, Salute. It was Spiral. It, I mean, like, we had so many Shuma players. It's definitely starting to get to that point with Deadpool. We, we have enough that are competent enough and strong enough and practiced enough. B-Man also, I think, another one that we're just starting to see this kind of kind of more regular appearance of Deadpool in the meta. Shout out to Bruno kind of getting away with one as Jason was just beating his skull in. He escapes. Back in the neutral. So we changed things up a little bit from the wedge archetype. We, tra we trade out Strider and the Vajra assist for Hawkeye and the, uh, the Greyhound. It's pretty solid. It's super fast. We've seen Dual Kevin represent this team. B-Man also represent this team. Everybody knows by now. Pretty damn good. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay. Let's go. We hit knees. Aww. Aww. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> he was combo, went through the MS. And then one drop and Jason made him pay. And he did the down TAC because he's Jason. He's rude as hell. Double pipe might be my favorite, like, combo fix. Fair. <laughs> just, just for no reason. Absolutely fair. Unadulterated violence, dude. On all, like you said, off a drop combo, man. He was wading his way through. This is the cheapest setup in the in the business. Oh my god! And he adds another stupid layer. I legitimately wasn't thinking about. Oh my god! And he gets the tag. Has plenty of time to close the distance. Hawkeye definitely gonna go down. And kiddo, pretty dominating first game there, man. Dominant indeed. Uh, Bruno had a chance. They were definitely fighting at one point, but the uh, mess, man, it's real. It's not something that we like to mention very often, but it's certainly real in this case. Oh, the counter hit headbutt. Yikes. Yeah. Yikes. I mean, that's just like the type of player that Kiddo is. You really can't make mistakes against him. If you find that first hit, you, it has to convert into like a game winning or near yeah, game winning scenario, or you are just like. It, it's always even if he's alive, mm. <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh, that's brutal. That's so brutal. His incomings are so sharp, man. Okay, Bruno, perfectly spaced. I see you. We reset. Almost get the cross-up confirmed. Ooh, that's another one of those moments, though. You had an opportunity. Doesn't turn into anything, and now dude, the lion stalks his prey. We're going to do it. Choose a super. We catch the assist. Okay, I see you. He's, he's, oh, he's just gonna nuke. I got a really God. good decision, actually. Hagar Yo. might have to spend X Factor. That might hit him, so I might go under. Yeah, he had the X. Like this. This is solid for Bruno. And he's Hagrid's out of there. Low. This is huge, actually. I think it's winning for Hawkeye, mm -hmm. for sure. And the throw. Ooh, we... I... It's so weird when that happens with the Hawkeye. The back throw. I don't even know why it doesn't work sometimes. Nice juggle. Man, Bruno had so much momentum. He was trying so hard. Playing really, really sharp. Jason kind of waits him out. Another throw. This time we get it. Team for sure. Team Super. They have such a good Team Super, too. I know Dante just is a part of every best Team Super in the game. But, like, notably, Hawkeye's so good with him. Very true. Get to cheat with a lot of extra damage on the poison arrow. Super fast confirms. Kind of just makes things really consistent. And Hawkeye really struggles with damage a lot of times. So, it just checks a lot of boxes. And, of course, Jam Session, one of the best assists. Yep, we're trying to create some space here. I like what you said earlier. Jason stalking. Dude. <laughs> Oh, that's a heartbreaker that that doesn't confirm. Kiddo actually dropped a very rare drop from Kiddo in response. Mm. Dude. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Bruno can do this. 
We're not gonna do this. He's gotta survive. Oh my god. Corner closing Shoot in on him guns. like a coffin. He gets out! No! Oh, train. but you're, you're never fully out against this guy. You mentioned the trades earlier against the Nova. Ooh, it pays off big here. And we get the flame carpet and the stalking flare. All the nonsense. We get out? No. Yeah, I mean, you have X to potentially get out of that spot, but still, X factoring in the A, you're going to have to end up blocking his Hagar. He still has Dark Hole Assist. There's so many extra layers that to deal with. And this is going to do plenty of damage. Cow Flame is so strong. Come on, Hawkeye. Come on, Hawkeye. Okay. He's getting his needs to TAC. We're chilling. We're chilling. Ooh, that was we're so not chilling. smart. It actually just covered everything. That was uh, that was back roll. If you neutral tech, you get flame carpet. If you uh, uh, if you back tech, you get flame carpet. Jeez. That sucks. No. Again. Oh, you know what else sucks? Oh, <laughs> Counter hit headbutt, head dude. dude. Oh. The dizzy birds are so disrespectful. It already I feels horrible. It. He needed yeah. it. Yeah. He needed it. Yeah. Hagger rules. I don't care what anybody says. He's <laughs> like, kind of cool. He rules. Playing him is so addicting, too. Oof. After being chased by this character for so long, it definitely feels good to be the one doing the chase. Yes. Chasing. I will say that. 100%. Keeps it pretty simple. One bar is going to do it. Now it's up to Hawkeye. Hawkeye has a solid matchup against... At least a couple of these characters, but combined all together, yikes. Oh. Oh. That was a, such an ugly confirm. Uh oh. We're out. We're chilling. We got this. We're fighting back. Kiddo is. a lot of work. Dude, set the dummy to. Oh, back. Jesus, bro. He's <laughs> completely out of there. I mean, for good reason. Taking a ton of chip on this, but losing one character to this is not a big deal at all. Yeah, and it doesn't even lose the Hagger, really, until the end. X-Factor all the way gone. No confirm on Dormammu. I mean, Hawkeye does kind of okay against Dormammu, but the Destructor is backing him up. Just like that. Yikes. Dude, Jason Kiddo. Doesn't even need to spend two bars. One will do it. Three to one, kiddo. Headed on forward through the bracket. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I just slept for, for a month and a half. I just slept. Oh, Speaking dude. of sleep, you know, even I had to quit. Mora. Yeah, I had to quit. I had to take a break. I didn't you know, know yeah, listen. TNS, I, I, I was breaking the rules. They were like, get on the bench, dog. You got to be stronger than that. <laughs> get on the bench, dog. <laughs> Uh, got promoted the spectator, bro. So it's not just a meme. Oh my god, you're ridiculous. Oh my god. Speaking of ridiculous, Wedge actually getting the first hit huh? here. Hello, Deadpool winning a neutral against Zero. Excuse me. Huh? More likely than you think. As Whoa. we get that same old mix-up that we've seen so many times. It's so effective in the mid-screen as WD, my he did hero. It. Even of, I don't even care about it making it over 50 to 51. We got double zeros on the end. That's my goat. Shout yeah, out to WD, man, for the 727. Thank you. Appreciate it. 100%. Ooh, Wedge is just on all cylinders right now. Doing all the layers. Another mixy. Jeez. Double mixy. Didn't even need it. They both hit. We are out of teleport, though. I think he can reset in the incoming. I'm not sure. Uh, this should kill, I think. Oh, uh, yeah, you got time. Yep. Yeah. Choose to keep offense. Block foot dive. So Ramora has to. Yo, Dude, the chat, listen. That button is so weird. That, what is up with that button? That is. Hey, if you're going to watch the YouTube video, his trailer was that exact sequence. Yes. That sequence is insane against Doom. That's the one. That's the one, dude. Contest his entire approach, legitimately. That button into the quick work, so nicely done from Wedge, just playing some real mastery of the character. And he just hits zero. Oh, what? Right off rip? Kill him. Kill him. Kill him in the mix. 
Do it again. This is what War of Warcraft does to you. Oh my god, bro. Leave the WoW out of this, bro. Oh my god, but he is absolutely getting hit by everything. This is a lot. Weds with the resets over and over. More is trying to take, uh, I mean, when you're, especially when you're playing on the, uh, the higher ping, you've got to take more aggressive stances to get out of certain situations here, but Wedge is just, man. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So cooking right now, if you're Wedge. Yeah, you pop the X, but super worth it. Dr. Doom has to deal with the same crap he did last time that is so ambiguous. This has been the Deadpool show. This is going in the next guy. Yeah, so perfect to follow up as well. Wedge, gonna make it two games now. Gonna pop the explosion just for next game, you know. Get ahead of the situation. Okay, classic Nomura. Lame it out a little bit in the character select. Take some time. Try to slow things down. We see this pretty often from him. I like it. Chillin'. Okay, so 99 seconds, obviously. Gonna be a, 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 a tough one to swallow for sure. Gotta be careful about how it starts. And we play it super chill Dog. as we get to right away. Dude. Huh? We got a Virgil uh. and a Dream. I love the that he side down. switches too. He side switches to mid screen as well. Time for the left, right. The block on the high and the X Factor cancel. He's in there. We're live. Chat, we're live. It's lit. It's Rami Mommy time. What's the setup? Meaty. Oh, he, he tried to double jump Beautiful. out of there too. He saw the glyph underneath him for the double jump. Yikes. It's over. There we go. Ramon yes. was just saying in chat that he can't do anything against this, bro. He just cooked him. 2-1. We got a Virgil's chance, baby. We got a Virgil's chance. <laughs> We're in there. <laughs> oh, God. That did look really bad for him, though. So we're lucky that the, that the Virgil paid off. But no, man. We want the zero active. We're more low-key kind of known for the Virgil, though. Bro, he is like crazy. against this team comp. I think generally the right call is like kill snap. Uh, I think especially against Remora, it's kill snap. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, Remora got a good Doom. Don't get me wrong. But I agree. With your team, you should be able to shut it. Down. Absolutely, dude. Wedge's team is designed only for killing dudes. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, oh my god, dude! But it's not gonna matter. A missed position gets a foot dive to the face. He's gonna snap. What a block! I like the snap. Really great block from Wedge. Gets out of the situation. The bird bomb into the hard tag. Yikes. Monta gonna soak this damage. Oh, he committed to the age. Oh, he glitching. We don't get the round trip. Deadpool kind of gets away. And the jam says she. We will take that straight to the bank. There she goes him out. You're done again. And Virgil's like really late, which is good. So it's going to have a little bit more time. He's going to get Jam Session back a little earlier. He's able to jump out of that one. Oh, poor guy. Dr. Doom's going to have to fight for his life. Come on. Get in there. Get mean. Get after it. Oh, just kidding. Get quick work. Wedge is a sniper. Nice shot. Finds him at exactly the moment he needed to. Bread and butter looks pretty good to me. It does get himself to the level two. That's uh, usually one of the only worries I feel like in the, uh, maybe it's just like my, uh, like a misconception I've created in my brain. You ever talk yourself into something? That's the man. <laughs> Blocker is here and he's ready to go. Blocker is here. We can start our match. Two favorites of probably any bracket they could enter. 100%. Flocker versus LT, and Flocker gets the hit early. This is what you want. Obviously, we hype up LT Spencer a ton. It is amazing, but the Nova is the engine of this team. No, Flocker drops the loopy. <laughs> oh, and doesn't get the punish either. Tries to go for the high, low, and LT. Pretty easy block on that one. Confident. Yeah, I mean, it's just one of those ones. You're flipping coins. It doesn't matter how seasoned you are, how good your defense is. You are uh, you're at the mercy of flipping coins when the uh, the little blue man is on screen. 
Yep, Spencer's gonna have to hold this. No HP will save you. No amount of health is safe. He's gonna have to spend the second bar. Oh, gladly. Get him out of here. What's our layer gonna be for the incoming setup? It's Dr. Doom. We probably keep it meaty the whole way through. Yes, we do. <laughs> Oi. <laughs> That's That's Absolutely. And that is uh, Flocker just taking a little bit of chip from projectiles, and otherwise, that is pretty much a wrap. Should be able to do it. Even if this dropped on some weird stuff, X Factor already gone. LT, you're out of that one. There's no way. It's okay, though. It's all right. First of three. Sometimes you just let it go, move on to the next game. Obviously, he's not going to take it super personally. Ooh, but Flocker opens up for the second time with the hit in neutral. Are we gonna are we gonna finish our line? Come on. Come on, champ. Come on, champ. Come on, Florida's best. Okay. Actually that's right. Hey man, you know what I'm hey, saying? Yo. What's okay. the incoming? I see yep. you, GR. Hey Bubby. Ooh. Oh my yeah. god. He does actually get out of it though. Double over oh, he double dip on that against the Evo hey, he won Evo. You did a double dip? I respect I respect no respect. You know what I mean? Yes. Oh absolutely. Thank you, GR, for the sub. We appreciate your general reaction. Ooh, wee! Off the Tarzan swing? I didn't even know you could convert that. Well done. Ouch. Nothing. No. Hello? We chill? Too much chill? Oh my god, he almost got the firm too. It'd be so hard for him to do this. It'd be so hard. Yeah. He tried to. Actually, he had him though, I think. That Spencer was, was actually down backing when he went there. He didn't quite get close enough for the throw. That was a scary situation. Shout out to Gambit coming through with the Prime. Thank you very, very much again to uh, not only to Gambit, but to everybody who's been coming through and supporting tonight. Definitely a huge shout out to everybody. It's been really, really nice to have. Uh, Mm -hmm. I don't know. Fridays Another are relaxing. Another primer, baby. Fridays they are relaxing. relaxing. We have this many homies coming through. It's, it's definitely the the cookout vibe, man. Love to see it. The chat's been live. Ooh, and this combo starter is super live. Yikes. You lose the zero. You lose the Virgil. We saw how hard the Hawkeye got punished before. Shout out to Shadowclone with another subby to Aeonian. Love you both. What's Hawkeye going to do? Man? He's going to try. He's Hawk try right now. Oh, okay. Still finds a hit off of that, actually. Definitely a weird spot for that to happen in, but it's still fine. Spencer. One down. Double. Oh, I thought he went double explosive. Only goes for the one. It works out perfectly. He's going to get the kill, and he's going to get into the bad matchup here. As long as he doesn't overextend on his incoming, which he's just going to chill, which I think is definitely the right call. Peppering him. What you do, 100% this is what you do. Make it annoying. Don't don't do anything except just shoot. Not moving. No dashing. Hello, LT was ready though and scouts. What, what direction are we rolling? He wakes up. Snap. Oof. That was so smart. Walker. That's championship smarts right there. Two one lead over LT. Man. Mm -hmm. Oh, and he snipes the up back, brother. How are we seeing? I can't believe this would. I mean, this would still be an upset, right? Well, absolutely. I mean, LT has a uh, kind of stamped his mark as like the most consistent online player. Obviously, room takes, champion. takes it takes it offline as well. Obviously, a super super strong player. No disrespect, calling him like consistent online, but like, man, he uh, he gets the job done wherever he plays. No, I think that's fair, man. He literally came up on the Parsec era. That's where he started, and that's where he gets most of his business done. Right now, Flocker's getting it done, though. A dead Spencer will be huge. Don't drop this. Don't drop it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was so low. And he just casually jumps over. Not a care in the world. Hmm. What? Oh, we get it. It happens. Every oh, now and then, it happens. Dude. No way. Pain. Good form. We take those. Doesn't matter. Yeesh. No conversion. He's playing a little close to the sun. LT lights him up for it. Gets to confirm on zero. Should be more than enough. 
Okay. You take it. Yep. Definitely the right call. And this gets you in your best position for mix up, best position for neutral here. Virgil coming in. Virgil kind of a sitting duck, and LT loves to command throw, but we're not even going to have to see it. Ooh. If that gets blocked and you push block at a bad timing, he gets a guaranteed command throw depending on how, if you have like X Factor or uh, kind of where you ended up. That's the classic, bro. That's the dissected on YouTube mix up. The mundane special. He hitting him with it again. Did you watch the YouTube video? Oh my god, the commando attempt is obliterated. And again, the bad matchup. But X Factor's still running down, so he's not going to have a. There's no consequence for this blocking he's doing here. This is just building meter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We get, the X Factors are almost forced out. Advantage definitely still blocker. We, oh. He's just shooting, bro. He's from the hip. 100% from the hip. Oh, we go in. Oh my That's god. It. And again, two standing mediums in a row. And then the Ant Man to follow. Walker, three to one. LT to the losers. LT to the losers early, too. Mm -hmm. Because LT to the losers before, like, winners' finals is kind of early for this guy. <laughs> Absolutely a talented Dude. player. Yeah, really, really good. Plays the Morgan. Plays optimally, too, so taps into a little bit of that theory potential that floats around with Morrigan um, and gets labbed out pretty deeply. So not just your usual soul fist spam, or you know that's going to be part of the plan. Already at the start, steam heavy as your ant here in a spot like that. Kiddo is still going to come down with the button, though. Not too worried about it, doesn't look like. We saw this strategy from Jason earlier when he played against the exact same team with Apology Boy. Starting the Domamu against the Morrigan with great success. Ooh, just a stop sign. Just no. You're not approaching me. And gets the punish on the tag. No conversion. Yikes. Yikes. And a miss. What's going on? Yeah, definitely a little sloppy between the two ends up popping the X Factor to get the health back on the characters. I feel like for certain team comps, this is better than others. Uh, for this team in particular, I think it's a great call to get your health back. Whip into whip, so we have to double, triple. We're going the whole way through. Had to do it. Put the swords on the back end, and we get the pressure, which leads to the kill. A juggle on the assist character is just bonus. Okay, I'm going to address these in order. Corky, thank you. I love you. e -back, I that's not my hat. That's Tamperoth's hat. Little Monix, <laughs> come see me. I hate you. There we go. There you go. That's my, that's my three in a row. <laughs> that's Tamperoth. Whoa, what's that's going Tamperoth. on? Okay, he was doing it. He was doing it. I thought Morgan was stuck for a second, but he was just chilling. Loses his Doctor Doom. It's all Jason right now. Massive life lead, X Factor lead, meter lead. Super triple. I think he's gonna land a block. Nice. Couldn't quite get to the ground, but oh, it hit weird though. It hit really weird. He's still dead. <laughs> yeah, yeah, That's such a bad matter. moment. Player one wins. Gonna have a real bad time. Morgan full screen with no meter, no X against Dormammu. That's like arguably. Maybe her, like, worst matchup? I don't know. If she has bad matchups, this is definitely one of the only ones that I think you can even have a yeah, conversation about. I don't want to call about. it a bad matchup, but it no, certainly yeah. feels pretty good for Dormammu. I'm not yeah, trying to give the Morgan players any ammo. It's one of those ones where I feel like when Dorm gets spells, it uh, once he has some momentum ramped up, uh, it can get kind of messy. But if he doesn't have, if he never gets room to get spells and never gets room to start ramping at all, uh, I don't think it's very good. Good stuff. It's particular. It feels even-ish to me, just uh, as a as a spectator, you know. I see you, Gambit. I see. Oh, we get the stun on the Doom Assist. But Jason sort of sits on top of it and uses that as a point of control. Nothing comes of it. Means he gets into neutral. This is what you want if you're the Morgan player. Start getting these projectiles engaged. Nice. Good time to challenge. We get the juggle. Probably get it a, another reset into neutral. No, we go for the TAC. Okay. Please don't drop this in the Gilaria. Please don't drop this in the no, Gilaria. We're fine. We're fine. Please don't drop this in the Gilaria. There's memes we're talking about, man. There's memes we're talking about. Oh, that does no damage. He's out of there. It's okay. 
Okay, I, I'm shocked that it didn't actually hit. Seemed like a pretty meaty soul fist to me. Guess it missed. But Dormammu is engaged. No chaotic flame though. That's a pretty big check that he usually wants against Morgan, against the missile assist. Super clean cool movement to get out of there though. Oh, Jason got that. We we definitely know. You have to be very careful about how you shell kick against Dormammu though, because you gotta remember his launcher is right. uh fairly disjointed upwards. Yeah. <laughs> it's a pretty good anti-air. He like has legit in between the crouching medium and the launcher. They're both just psycho hurt boxes, hurt spheres. And he definitely is like one of the main abusers of the spheres, dude. The spheres. <laughs> they were really on something when they made this game, man. I love it. Uh huh. I wish I could do it again. I know. Give me more spheres. Nice <laughs> more rush down spheres. attempt. Memes, memes kind of blocks everything, though. Definitely looking really good. I think as memes here. If we can get to, oh, I was going to say there's the potential for a raw tag, but I think you're just kind of looking for two meters to get just anyone else in. Yes, this is a position of power right now for me to make cry. A lot of dominance. Good situation. All your assists are alive. Look at how bleeding Jason is on bar. Uh, okay, I mean, it's, it's all right. We get the kill. we got to cage this Magnus, though. Do not let him out. Caged. He's out. Oh, oh no. And it oh, was the brother. perfect timing for the throw, too. You got to X now. You don't have time, I don't think. Yeah. The sooner the better. You you got a lot of life to get through. Clean hit would give it a chance. Because then you are ahead of Morgan. Ooh. Ugh. Sick. I'm ill. Disgusting. He's alive. It doesn't matter. It literally Still doesn't matter. Fine. All right, Memes, Memes has to find the hit now, and that Can't. should do it. Yeah, with that EM Disruptor connecting, I think, is the nail in the coffin for sure. Oh, he accepts it. Holds the KO. Goes out on the sword. I don't want to see the timeout. Nah. Oof. 2-0 lead for Jason right now. He's been doing it to the Morgan players today. We got to jail this Dormammu somehow. And you can't get it done before he gets the three spells locked, and it's going to be really rough. Okay, soul drains. Oh, I had an opportunity for a punish, but, I mean, you see Hagar coming in. It's, just, it's too scary, dude. And your assist takes a grip for it, too. Moving him back. Okay, we got a juggle. Chooses to disengage. Oh, they both get hit. Nicely done. Jason paying attention. Converts with X Factor and kills. Dr. Doom's gonna come in bleeding. He's just gonna chip him, man. It's all right, cool. That's cool. Wait a minute. Uh oh. Wait a minute. That's not gonna beat that. Mm, he doesn't have time will. to teleport. Yeah, has to block. Doom dead. So that means we have the Virgil's chance. So eloquently put before, and it is active. Homebreaker gets us started. Put on the double trigger. Yes. Cages, man. Oh, what? Jesus, what? dude. Huh? What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> uh, <laughs> couple Memes odd situations in a row, dude. Beam is trying to go crazy. He does get the throw, but I don't think it's. No, yeah, he built the yeah, bar. I think he's we got build. it. I think he's got it. I think he builds another one. We go, baby. Do we even need it? Nah. Memes on the board. 2-1. Fighting back. Virgil's chance. Screw it, bro. Just start Virgil. Oh, I'm just playing. He starts Hagger. Interesting. What do you think about that? Jason switching to start Hagger this time. I, I think it can work. It was like I was talking about earlier when we saw him against uh, Apology Boy. I think that... Uh, I think that kind of suicide Hagar start can work out really well. Once you get to your two bars, you can uh, potentially go for the DHC, because it's screen out with Dormammu, stalking Flare if there's no Astral. There's a lot of upside. The downside is Hagar is going to take this amount of damage every time. Unless yeah. the Morgan makes a huge error, this is just like par for the course. Ooh. But there's that error we're talking about. Nobody's perfect, man. Yeah. Paid the cost of doing business. 
40% on life to just to close the distance. Makes the most of it when he gets there. Jason finds a hit. Destroys this Morgan. All the momentum on his side with the setup coming in, playing carpet down. Tag in. We've seen it once. We've seen it again. Think he's going to snap back? Nope. Psych. Mm, <laughs> I like this. No, 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 no. I definitely like this. Yeah, because he gets the setup, right? Oh, he's not going to go for it. He's just going to leave Hagar in. And wow, but it doesn't matter at all. He said it was all part of the plan. Easy peasy for Jason Kiddo. Spend that bar. Should be enough to kill. Damn. Yeah. Jason Kiddo. Damn. 3-1. Moving ahead over his second Morgan player of the night. Morgan Doom Virgil versus Nova Spencer Doom. So as far as theory teams go and... Also, in practice, these are two of the most successful teams that we've had in tournament history of Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Um, piloted by two, you know, relatively un you know, uncommon pilots. So, and these are not folks that we get to see super often in this tournament. So, nicely, or nicely done. Both of them getting to the top 16 winner's side. Show kick advances. Ooh. Nova fighting now. Getting a little wiggly in the corner. We get the back throw. Apology Boy chooses to go on offense, too. Yeah, okay. Okay. The meter has been forced out from both sides. They both have another one built. Nova gonna try to hang on to it here. The Astral Vision has been pretty solid, I think. For what you want to get out of an Astral Vision, it's not the most, but I think it's done enough. D-Hood probably feeling the pressure a little bit. Has to go for the, the speed tackle. Get the punish on the assist, but Morgan's still doing her thing, man. Jeez Louise. Now Spencer tags in. He got to deal with it. Psych. He ain't got to deal with nothing. Zip in and punch him in the head. Yes. With the Nova extension. Easy. Money. What's the setup going to be? What are we doing on income? We're going to go for the Monday. We're going to go for the Coach D. We're going to bring in Nova. Keep it nice and needy. Ooh, we jails him the whole way through. Catches him trying to up back with the slide. Yes, sir. We're gonna snap? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, do that, do that. Ooh, didn't even use the Spencer assist. Didn't need it. No chance. Sit there, Virgie. Cook him. Who's one? Who's bringing in? Nova? Yup. Running back. Same stuff as before. Keeps it nice and meaty. Forces the X-Factor. We got the speed tackle. Yes, sir. Convert it. Nope. Convert it into death. Converting in hell. Good sequence from Apology Boy. Hey, yo. Better sequence from D-Hud. That was the X-Factor on the Bionic Arm metagame we were talking about earlier. It has gotten so weird on when you should push Guard Spencer and when you shouldn't. They're both trying to time it perfectly. Soul Fist, Soul Fist, we're back at it. No, we're trying to lame it out. I see you, Wolf. What's up? I see you, Ice Sarah. Hello, guys. Welcome, welcome. D Hug gets over top of it. Makes some space. Hey, yo. The stutter step. Oak dope. Dolphin kick. Tag in the beam, but we miss it. No. No. Sucks. Now you let Morgan back into neutral with Dr. Doom on the screen. This is a bad matchup. And your back's against the wall. Ouch. Ouch. We get Nova back in. And we catch her. We catch her in the startup of the fly. Kill. 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 No. The reset and then it freezes the super. Oh, oh no. That looked like ping. That looked like playing on ping. Apology Boy gets pressed into the corner. Apology Boy loses the Morgan. Ooh wee! See Coach T break that out a time or two. We're not going to snap because Virgil, the X Factor, has already been expended. We're just going to kill. I don't hate this. This is it. Pick him up, put him down, yes sir. What's the what's the mix? Okay, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Keep it nice and meaty. 
super optimal. Yeah, Bird is not coming back in this. 2-0 lead D-HUD. Overcoming what I would say is probably the bad matchup. Nova versus Morgan. Nova, Nova fights all the top tiers pretty well. So I don't think any of these matchups are necessarily bad. But I would still say Morgan still wins. What's the response going to be? We take a number more timeout. I like it. Smart season move. Ice things off. Wipe your hands a little bit. Think about it. Take a breather. Huh. Yo, Wolf. Your English teacher hit you with the Kung Pound, bro? That's hilarious. Alright. Here we go. Game three. Apology boy down 2 0. Gotta dig deep, find the way back. Mm. That's not the way to do it. Throw early on. Hard tag into Doom. This should be efficient. Oof. We're already thinking about plan B. How are we gonna get Dr. Doom out safely and bring in Virgil to play the Virgil Missile Shell? Unfortunately, Morgan, this set so far has not been doing it. Oh, and he gets yoked again. I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess we're snapping. That's just my guess. Yes, sir. Needy. Javelin into Plasma Beam. Okay, but we get out. Oh, that's so unfortunate as soon as he goes for that. But it's getting scrambly, so Virgil gets out. Come on. Get the old-fashioned. The move that was built to do it. Is that the old-fashioned now? That's the old-fashioned. Just the crossover slash. Get yeah. hit. Hey, get the tag. Mm. Jumping, yeah, tag is noggin. All of Spencer's jumping buttons are absurd. Busted. Jumping light, busted. Jumping medium, busted. No, he drops. Unfortunate. Hard tag in Doom. And the foot dive. The, the save from the Nova assist. Not this time, though. Not this time. Yeah. We're gonna burn the level three? Absolutely. He has still got X Factor though, that's scary. Yeah, Feels especially, scary. Especially with no X Factor here. I mean if you find a hit and you can TAC, things can work out really, really well. But like that's a that's a big if, right? Big if. Massive. That's like, you know, when you're doing the, the Word document and you pick the largest font. Oh my god. The largest font. It's a, if. a 76 page essay, it just says <laughs> Helmbreaker. <laughs> Whoa! Apology Boys team is bleeding. Oh my god. Get out of there! Get him out of there! Not like that! That's not what I meant! I don't think he meant to throw the round trip there. That's a little unlucky. He injected into my life. So I can start thinking about fun things for the community again. That's what I'll say. And the other thing I'll say... What am I looking at? I forgot that Jumpman plays Chris Wesker also. Living Legend forced the X-Factor early. Yeah, definitely a weird one. Amy, the, the lockdown. Setup, though. So he is definitely in the uh, he is the blue team on a laser tag field for sure. Yeah. <laughs> just the blue dog also. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Living Legend doing this kind of cool in and out gameplay, but then he just gets caught jumping and finally dialed in and said, hey, that's a cool player. You want to dance around? Here's a bread and butter. I got you. Yeah, no problem. Not looking too worried about it. Link established. Set up. Awfully dry. Has to be. It's Chris. Keep the nice and media. The cold star follows up. Cool to see a monorail. So, you know, Amy, not really a character that, that survived too long. Playing in the, it in the late meta. Playing in the second spot, too. So, it, uh, it has the OTG assist with it. I'm interested mm -hmm. to see if that ends up being a, a factor of any kind. But Wesker comes in immediately with the buns. I don't know what kind of respect Chris was expecting him to have. Mm -hmm. But, uh, man, none of that. This is sick, man. I like seeing Jumpman in this bracket. I like seeing the different characters. Oh! oh, oh. Yo, that was Chris knowledge. He didn't get the full extension, but that was definitely some Chris knowledge. Oh my god, shoot the dog. Jesus! 
Wow, Wesker tried to pull the thing. He said, bro, you are outgunned. Please relax. What's the setup? Keeps it meaty. Tries to bait and has actually baited himself. Bruh? Bruh. Yep. Absolutely. Because of the slowdown, you get uh, you just uh, kind of juggle around for an extremely long time. And I believe that Team Super only works because of the slowdown also, because you have more time to actually have it. Uh, the grenades connect. I do believe. I love when he does stuff like this, man. I just love it. It's it's so unique too. Like it just it really is a brand of their own. Jumpman Jam bringing this down. The elemental working with the elemental too. It's just it's just tight. Oh What's no! Drop is a big deal. I already know YouTube about to love this set. Uh oh. Meaty. Dude, the cr <laughs> the Wesker assist in that spot is so <laughs> I don't know what is funny about it, but that's so funny to me. It, it just looks very like pieced together, but also like it was meant to be. Ooh, Demon Flip is good. Punish on Ami. Ooh, that's the classic, man. That Tatsu always catches you at the end. He's gonna nuke the assist character. And Chris falls down with the button. No. Oh, yeah, I was trying to press something here. That was perfect timing on everything to jump over, completely get across, is able to find the throw. Everything just works wonders. All or nothing goes right into it. Get this guy out of here. Spins the cheddar. Wesker Chris is probably the, the team order that we want at this point. Machine Gun Sist is like, it's okay. It's like solidly okay. It's definitely a horizontal assist, <laughs> but unfortunately not mattering too much there as he gets a clean hit. Jump man mm. might just 3 0 legend. That is trying not to... something we would uh, expect to see, I don't think. Nah, and he's trying to do it with, with the legend shell as well. So, hey, yo. Established dominance. T-pose for dominance. I like what I'm seeing. The combo's good. Chris got all that life, though. What are we going to do? Reset? Yep. <laughs> Dude, I love how he uses Wesker assist so much, man. Yes, I definitely appreciate that. Back in the neutral, Jumpman finds a second hit. He's dead. Proxy's dead. Dude, and he built so much bar doing it too because the flame door. He's almost at five. No, he gets caught. The okay, Ami assist doing his job. Are we going to snap? Or are we going to reset again? He's going to go all the way through. I think he just kills. Mm -hmm. No, no. He resets. Oh, I like this though. I guess a character like Wesker who doesn't really have anything to get out of that. He might as well just run him over. It's a good idea. Space him out, spend a bar since you're capped on resources. The super meaty nade. Dude, and he tags again. Double light palm into level three. And the worst part is, you don't even get to see the extension because he's just dead. Okay. All right. All right. I'd seen, I'd seen the, the slow setup before.